Hey guys, so I was here too, and today I review the Mega Constructs Despicable Me 3 Rules uh, Car. So, uh, yeah, so this is uh, not the not quite the Bruce car. It's the mini version of it, I guess. But yeah, uh, so it's recommended for just six and up, and comes with sixty nine pieces, and this set FDX seventy six. Uh, so. Yeah, you can see, uh, there is the place where you put the figure on, and, uh, yeah, you also got, uh, this guy, which I think is a day for something, but, yeah, so this is the top, bottom, the side, and the other side, and finally the back shows you, all, shows you the feature, uh, for the car, uh, which is just this spinning thing, but, yeah, so that's it for the box. So this is the instruction manual here. Uh, so you can see this is all the parts uh, list, and also here shows you how to build the figure. But uh, actually, it's uh, already like assembled. So you know, and yeah. So this is the first page of the build, and yeah, uh, this is the final page, and. Yeah, so here shows you uh, the sets uh, for the w the wave that this set came out in, and yeah, uh, it's mainly for the Despicable Me Cree, and yeah, you also got this uh, prison break thing, and yeah, so this is just the uh, the figures collection, I guess, checklist sort of thing, and yeah, uh, they they actually didn't say the character's name though, which is kind of sad, but you know, uh, you got the you got all the characters and yeah uh, so that's it for the instruction so this is the figure that comes uh, in this set which is the Tim I believe uh, he's one of the main characters of the movie and yeah so uh, you can see just pretty basic minion stuff you just got his hair right up there and you know you got uh, this uh, his eyes and you know, uh, it's like this goggles part is on the this um, band, and uh, yeah, you also got his smile. And yeah, this uh, this body is uh, taller than the normal minions than usual. And yeah, you also got uh, this Gru logo thing. And yeah, we just got this uh, wrapping all the all around and. Yeah, the legs you can just move around, and yeah, just pretty basic minion stuff. Uh, he can move uh, his arms nicely, and yeah. So um, that's pretty much it for uh, the figure. So this is a uh, Gru's uh, car here. So actually, this thing is really tiny. But yeah. Uh, so let's off with the front, I guess. But yeah. Uh, yeah. So you can see, you got this really nice piece for the grill, which uh, which is just a one by two uh, towel piece uh, with these special textures on it. And you also got uh, these headlights, and you got this special shape. And yeah, like all these pieces, they are not in uh, offshore Lego. So yeah, it's nice to get them. And yeah, so uh, here you can put. Uh, Tim as the driver, I guess, and yeah, you can you can maybe put two minion figures, but yeah, one uh, is like probably the maximum, I guess. But yeah, so on the side you got this piece, which is uh, which I don't know what it is for, but yeah, uh, it's also a very uh, special piece uh, because Lego didn't made it at all, but. Yeah, like the color of this, like the texturing and everything, yeah, it, it looks really great, I, I guess, but, yeah. Uh, so this back part with uh, this exhaust, uh, you got this special piece with the connector at the end, and, yeah, so this engine part, uh, you got all these, uh, like, kind of cone pieces, uh, you, you also got this uh, middle piece, which is just a normal middle piece, I guess. Uh, and you know, it's stuck in the middle. And yeah, this thing, this whole part is only connected by one stud. And yeah, it's kind of, it, it does kind of fall off if you uh, touch it too much. But 
yeah, uh, you also got the sloping part, and you know, it just looks really weird, I guess. Uh, you know, this just drops down immediately, and you know, just slopes. And yeah, this just looks weird. And this thing you can turn it around because it's on a, a, a jumper piece. So yeah. Uh, but aside from that, uh, like that's pretty much it for the uh, build. I mean, like this. Uh, the only other interesting thing to point out is that uh, the the wheels they are uh, not wheels. They are just uh, these um, round pieces. They kind of look like cows, but. Yeah, they are the wheels for the vehicle, and yeah, they do roll really nice. So, yeah, that's uh, really it for uh, Gru's car, and yeah, that's pretty much it for the build. So, overall conclusion of uh, this set, so how do I think of it? Uh, well, uh, talk talking about the set itself, I think it's uh, really nice, uh, like the figure, um, it's definitely great to get uh, Tim, if he is really Tim. And yeah, the Grillo car, uh, I mean, nice to get a miniaturized version of it, but uh, they could have like just made the big version of it and, you know, just filled it with like Gru and the Minions, uh, but uh, yeah, it would be a very big set though, but you know, like, yeah, it, it does look nice, but yeah, it's just way too small, like you only get like six, 69 pieces and, you know, uh, like if you minus the parts for the minion figure, then it's 59. So 59 for this thing, it could have been a, like a poly bag. And yeah, this thing costs the um, the same as the a official uh, Lego uh, city starter pack. How much that would cost? Like yeah, just about the same. So. Yeah, it's really expensive, I'll say, and yeah, so overall, I just don't recommend you getting this unless you really like minions, and yeah, you want to collect these, but yeah, it's, it's just not a great set, I mean, unless you want the car, I guess, and some special pieces, but yeah, overall, I just don't recommend this set for the price, but yeah. Uh, if you want to buy the set, uh, I'll put a buy link down in the description box below if I can find it, along with all my social media pages down in the description. So if you like my channel, then make sure to subscribe right here and watch more videos right here. So that's it for the video. Thanks for watching, and I'll be seeing you very soon.